a night at Depot Bay in our truck camper, so we didn't have to wake up super early the next day for the real watching at 10. It's a one and a half hour real watching trip, and the ticket includes the museum too. Checked in 15 minutes before departure to watch a short video clip about the grey wheels so we can appreciate the wheel watching experience better and know what wheel behaviors to look out for. You go more towards you, you're gonna see the blue, beautiful heart shaped glow. Now, that's a grey wheel, it's a baleen wheel, it has two glow holes. All baleen wheels have two glow holes. So we're gonna see the glow, the back. There are 13 of us on this trip, not counting Carrie and her deck hen, and of course Kida, the wheel spotter. Kida will bark when she spots a wheel. I like it that we are going whale watching on a zodiac boat. Today we are taking the Comet, a 36 feet ex Navy SEAL vessel. The more front you are, the bumpier the ride will be. We are told that the front people aren't allowed to stand, but it's okay for the back people to do so when the boat is stationary. This is Depot Bay Bridge, the same bridge in One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, where Jack Nicholson's McMurphy takes a group of fellow residents out on a fishing field trip. Thank you. 
Really, I don't even know where. Oh, there it is! Then she said.
There it is!
Thank <laughs> you. 